Everybody is trying to decide which rogue spec is the best. Everybody is preparing for the patch 715 and a lot of people are anticipating the greatest things out of Blizzard and rightfully so because 715 brought a lot of changes. Some are very skeptical changes where it's like rogues got slow nerf. I mean that seems like it's gonna fuck up everything in terms of gameplay and then they're expecting people to grind a ton of AP for season 3. I mean it's like unrealistic expectations. I can't tell whether we're playing World of Warcraft or we're trying to get on a cover of CoverGirl Model Mag Magazine. But let's be honest, this is still is an exciting patch and a lot of rogues and a lot of other classes are willing to take on the challenge and everybody just wants to figure out what is the spec for them. So in this video I want to take a really brief look and later down the line I want to take a look at some of the other specs that are doing really really well in terms of rogues. We'll first start out with one of the fan favorites for this expansion which is Assassination. Assassination is a spec that's been doing a ton of damage ever since Legion got released and in 715 they're getting a blind bag, they have one of the coolest utilities in terms of a blanket silence, they have still one of the biggest bursts in the game, but will they be affected by 715 change? If anything I'd say the spec might be lacking slightly in the department of mobility as I would say Outlaw and Subtlety, especially Subtlety has a ton more mobility, but Assassination is definitely one of those specs that is definitely being considered and most people believe that this spec is going to be the best spec simply because of how much damage output it puts out and with most of the damage abilities being buffed with a blind thrown in there's just literally no way to counter an assassination rogue once they get their dots on you you are melting you are done you are out ski so a lot of people are suggesting you might want to be playing assassination but is that truly the best rogue spec some of the other people are saying subtlety is going to be the best one and I got the pleasure, the absolute pleasure of playing the new and refined subtlety. It's not quite refined in terms of completely different gameplay but the spec did improve in terms of damage and it feels like with the amount of CC, mobility and the current damage that it has in 715 it might be one of the more stable, one of the more successful specs and a lot of people believe that since it does have cooldown reduction mechanic for defenses and your CC you will have the most consistency with subtlety. So because of one of its abilities which is an auto talent while you're in stealth or in shadow dance the cooldown reduction of most of your abilities is reduced I believe by 30% effectiveness so you are going to be able to get your cooldowns back faster you're going to have sustained damage you have a ton of mobility you of course have a ton of CC to lock down healers and DPS alike so a lot of people believe that this might be the ultimately best spec right now most of the community is split between assassination master of poisons and subtlety which is a spec which is master of CC master of mobility master of sustained damage and in the past few expansions have have been proven to be one of the best specs for PvP in World of Warcraft since ever. But I do want to remind you guys, it's not only about assassination and subtlety. And a lot of people on the forums I see do kind of avert their eyes away from one of the specs as being least talked about. And I kind of do want to bring it to your attention in terms of some of the damage and abilities. So without further ado, enjoy.
since the patch has been released, I've been making videos and trying to figure out what spec is going to be the best. And I had people come up to me on live stream asking me, hey Dell, which spec do you think is going to be the best? Simply to ignore whatever I have to say and just tell me I'm flat out wrong and then tell me and answer the uh, question for themselves. Answer me uh, that assassination or subtlety are going to be the best specs for PvP. And those people might be right, subtlety and assassination might be the great because assassination has burst potential, damage and blind, and subtlety has a little bit more burst, so much control and consistency, plus a little bit of cooldown reduction. But I completely, I would not discount Outlaw Rogues out of the race just yet. Outlaw Rogues bring in damage, and if anything Legion has shown us, especially with Season 1, is that if a class or a spec deals enough damage, then they're 100% viable for PvP. And with the way Outlaw Rogue is with its unique defensives and its tricks to the check capabilities, I wouldn't discount the spec just yet. So give it a try if you haven't. Thank you guys so much for watching, I'll be checking out Subtlety in the next video and this was some of the footages that you were able to see. Please do let me know which spec do you uh, want to check out and please tell me. Please tell me that she'll give Outlaw Rogue one more chance. Thank you guys so much for watching, hope you enjoyed.